Hi friends, through our iCreate program, we used to deliver multiple websites every month. And we generally focus on two points while delivering the quality websites. The first is, it should be mobile friendly and very fast in loading. So we are delivering a website, every website that loads around in two to three seconds, even less. So basically we target one to two seconds loading time for every website on every page. And the second, the SEO aspects of the website should be very clear so that in the same may be easily rankable and indexable to the Google and other search engines. So I got a very important question uh, through our one of our existing members and I wanted to explain the same and share with all our visitors. The question is, how direct website visits impacts of a website ranking on the Google? So you clearly know what is direct website visits. When we type the domain name directly on our browser, and open a website that is called direct website widgets in general terms. So it is always assumed the number of widgets we are having through any medium is going to impact the ranking of our website on the Google and we are going to rank higher and we are going to get good page ranks on the Google. It is not like that. In this video, I'm just reading the theory that I got at Gemini itself, the platform of Google. And the question is again, very important. How direct website widgets impacts the ranking? So direct website widgets also known as direct traffic and can have indirect impact on a website ranking on the Google, but it has indirect impact, not, it is not impact going to impact directly of a website ranking on the Google. So this video may be boring for you. I'm just reading the theory, but yes, the question is really very important. And if you are serious about your website concerns and the ranking factors, you should know all these questions are going to be very important that you should understand and ask to your website developer or even to yourself, if you are developing a website and willing to have a very good rank on the Google. So the answer is very clear. The direct widgets are not a direct ranking factor. Google itself had stated that direct traffic volume is not a direct signal used in their ranking algorithms. This is because it is easy to manipulate and difficult to definitely track. Okay, so a direct way widgets can be generated through any mediums even we can generate direct website at our home uh, by opening the website again and again. So Google is not considering this factor, this uh, as very important because it can be manipulated. So it is not a deciding factor for Google to rank a particular website. However, there are indirect impact. So high volumes of direct traffic can send positive signals to Google in other ways. Let us see how it is mentioned here. So brand recognition, a strong showing of uh, direct traffic suggests that users are familiar with your brand and likely to find your content valuable. So it is very logical. So if your website is getting direct tra traffic from different IP address, different location, different geos, it means uh, the people are very much aware about your brand, your website, and they are willing to open your website directly and they know your URL, they know your domain name, and they are opening your website directly and willing to read the content available, willing to consume the content available at your website. So this is giving a positive signal to Google that also impacts the ranking of your website at Google. The second consideration can be user engagement. So if visitors coming directly to your site are 
staying for a significant amount of time and engaging with your content it tells google your site is relevant and meeting user needs so this can also boost your ranking so this is also important this is indirect impact but yes it is giving to giving a positive signal to google one important consideration is focus on quality traffic what is quality traffic so if google uh, our user search any terms on the google and uh, willing to have a certain information on the search topic or search keyword the results that google want to produce should be very relevant so while direct traffic can be a positive indicator it is more important to focus on attracting high quality traffic so high quality traffic can only be if a user is getting the information that actually he is willing to find it is going to be a high quality retention and regardless to the source uh, maybe it direct traffic or indirect traffic or search results this means this user who are genuinely interested in your content and stay engaged on your site so it is really very important what search results are bringing for users and how users are interacting with your content at your website so we can mark some seo strategy to consider that go beyond just direct traffic create high quality content so we have to keep the content in high quality and should be very uh, relevant for the users and search terms so focus on informative well written content that addresses your target audience needs so what we have to do i am just discussing secondly we can optimize for relevant keywords that we actually do at our i create program we used to optimize website content for relevant keywords it is very important and in the coming videos i am going to show all these things so uh, if you are coming to this channel and mm, very first time and not regularly watching videos so i must tell you you can subscribe this channel uh, for learning and discussing the core seo practices through which you can optimize your website and get a very good ranking on the google so the third is build backlinks secure links from high authority website in your niche this is a, a strong indicator and trust of credibility in the google eyes and again that we cover in our delivery improve user experience that is ui and ux this is why i am showing hundreds of themes hundreds of resources on this channel why you should choose a certain theme and how you can proceed with the customization and what should be the user experience user uh, interactions with your content so we mainly focus on improving the user experience and make sure your website is mobile friendly easy to navigate and loads quickly this is our main factor that we consider in every delivery and you have to focus on this point mainly because if your website is slow it is going to fail on the search engine indexes so if you are implementing such a strategy you can attract high quality traffic both directly through your through search engines which can ultimately lead a better google ranking so this video remained theoretical but yes i believe i have given you a uh, uh, suitable and considerable points for direct traffic and how it is going to impact your website in the coming videos i am coming with more resources keep watching keep building thank you